Welcome back. All that just ahead, but first, only on Nine on Your Side, a desperate attempt to save a fire victim falls just short. A Goshen Township man seeing his neighbor's home was on fire, rushed to try to save him, and now, just hours after this tragedy, he's talking about those fateful moments. Minutes ago, he spoke with Nine on Your Side's Jay Warren, and Jay, it seems he tried everything he could to save Ben Ledford. It sure does. This was so hard on him, too. The 10-year-old uh, boy, though, that lives there ran across the street to call 911. That's how Ron Mitchell found out about that. So Mitchell then ran back across the street to try to get into that front door to save 33-year-old Ben Ledford. Now, sadly, he was unable to do so. Ledford was sleeping downstairs in the basement at the time of the fire. Uh, here, he lives with the Waster family on Stella Drive. Now, two members of the family who live upstairs, they were out of the house. And then the other two, including that 10-year-old boy, were alerted by smoke detectors on the first floor. Now, the mother told her son to go call 911. And once the neighbor knew what was going on, he ran over to the house. I tried to climb through the front door. I got about a body's length in, and the smoke was so thick that I had to come back out. Um, then I went around the back of the door, or the back of the house, and saw that the dryer vent that was out the back, that window to the basement was on fire. Um, I tried to turn the hose on, which it's freezing out. The, the lines were frozen. So I went back to the front and yelled in the house for Ben and I heard some banging. Now you heard Mitchell talk about the fire coming out of the dryer vent. In fact, he says that the landlord has told him that firefighters believe that it was the dryer or the dryer vent that caught fire, though it's important to point out the state fire marshal's office has not released an official cause. Jay Warren, Nine Your Side, Goshen Township. Thank you, Jay.